everybody uh, just so i thought i'd do this it's quite late at night um but i need to do this video because i am back i've been away for a long time as you may know um i've actually been doing kind of two jobs um, because my main one is in a restaurant and i've had an opportunity to do uh some other stuff which was kind of related to computers and um i basically any time i wasn't at the restaurant i was working at uh working at this this other job thing and uh probably eight months later or so um it wasn't for me and uh i finished that and i've actually asked to do less hours at my proper job at the restaurant so i'm now uh, in a position with loads of time um and i'm also doing a lot with my other youtube channel a lot of you don't know about that but if you want to know what it's called um send me a, uh, a personal message because i want to keep that really separate um from everything else but if you want to know um let, let me know and I will uh, show you um, but I'm going to turn this light on as well it's a bit of extra light there we go um, yeah yesterday it was free comic book day who doesn't love free comics everyone loves free comics and uh, we um, it was great uh, we went to the Southampton Forbidden Planet at my local uh, and uh, I met Mark again it was great to see him great to see you Mark if you're actually watching this um, I haven't seen him since 2012 um, so yeah, it was good to see him again, um, and I am so yeah, I'm back. We're back in business, um, and I'm very behind with stuff. So I bought a few things uh, to show you as well, just to kind of get myself up to speed a little bit. Sorry, we've got a bit of a cold at the moment as well. I um, also noticed a comic book community page on Facebook that uh, Mark added me into. That was ages ago now, but there's so many people here now. Um, and uh yeah i've got a lot of people to subscribe to by the looks of things which is great um let me just see if i can make this lighting a little better because it's not the best but i'm obsessed, obsessed with lighting up there we go that's not too bad that's a bit better um so yeah i'm recording this it's about half ten uh, i'm about to go to bed but i thought i'd do this quickly um yeah so i'm wearing the same same shirt as uh if you see me one way before, uh, still got it. I've got a lounging around shirt. So let's take a look at what we got. So I'll go through the free comic book stuff, free comic book day stuff first, and then we'll go through the other stuff. Also, if people can recommend comics that you reckon I should be reading, because I'm miles behind, literally the last comic I had was, let me have a look. So the last ones I um, got sent to me were Planet Toy number four, uh, The Secret Service number five, and uh, Frankenstein's Alive Alive number two. So that will give you an idea on how behind I am, miles behind. I bought a few things to kind of catch me up as well, so hopefully we should be a bit nearer to uh, you know where we are now. So actually. Other things first, I watched uh, Captain America Winter Soldier the other day. You need to watch that if you haven't seen it. Bloody hell, that was good. Um, and that kind of inspired me, and I was like, I'm going to buy a Captain America shirt. So I bought that yesterday at HMV. There we go. Um, and I'm going to try and grow into it, as in bulking up, grow into it. I'm quite an avid member of the gym as well now, so. Uh, that's something that I'm into as well. You can't see it very much on camera, um, but that's my excuse anyway. Um, okay, so the free comic with day things. Let's go from this way. So we've got the Phoenix, the weekly story comic. Um, they generally, yeah, it's like the magazine. They generally put a magazine into the uh, into the uh, the goodie bag. So that's quite cool. So that was that. Let's go over this side. Uh, we have the Doctor Who Titan Comics preview. Need to remember where the light is. Um, Atomic Robo. This is uh, Red Five Comics. I've never heard of Red Five Comics. See, this is probably is a lot more companies products, but it says around now. By the time that I've kind of need to catch up with. Uh, making Spider-Man 2, Bleeding Cool, Free Comic Book Day, Sampler. 
hoping you'll be able to see this okay. This is using my front facing camera on my phone. Um, it's kind of easier as well because um, you know the quality has developed so much that the camera was using my little Kodak one. This is probably better quality than that, and I can upload it direct with the app, so it works quite well. Um, hopefully it'll be okay. I think the sound's quite good off as well, so hopefully it should be okay. Hopefully, just give me a bit of feedback if you would, guys. Um, Uber Illustrated by Calm White, February 2014. This looks like an actual issue. Although it's got free on it. Anyway, is it Fed? Sorry, not Feb. You can't see this very well because it's, it's very late in the night, so it's a bit dark, a bit gloomy. Um, we've got Rise of uh, is that Magi or Mage? Zero, issue zero. Uh, don't worry, next time the lighting will be better. This is just the best I can really do. I'll tell you what. You pause the video for a second. Actually, no, we can do it. We'll do it live. If you guys don't mind long video. I've kind of adapted to not like long videos doing my other stuff, but never mind. You you guys should be alright. You, you won't mind, will you? Let me just put that like that. There you go. The guy's better, isn't it? There you go. It's all better. So, uh, we've got the 2000 AD. Also, these were kind of in a... Uh, Along with the counter, so you could literally go one, 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 one of each. Thank you very much. We got there um, 25 past eight, and they opened at nine, um, so we were like pretty early. Mark was there, uh, pretty much at the front of the queue. Um, but it was nice to meet the other fellows yet with them as well. Um, but yeah, there's a lot of people I don't know about in the, the community now, so I must get sorted on that. I did watch his um, unbagging last night as well. Um, last night slash this morning um, but yeah it's nice nice of you to mention me as well Mark I do appreciate that thank you very much fella um, so 2000 AD yeah everyone was kind of after this there's 48 pages worth in here as well so that leads me on nicely that's actually quite a good shot leads me on nicely to um, mentioning about John Higgins was there as well doing um, signatures of his new book um, I was going to get one, but we we're too late for the sign-in. Oh, he probably would have done it anyway, but he was doing some awesome artwork as well, using just like Sharpies, ballpoint pens. Um, I think it was just Sharpies and ballpoint pens, primarily and Tipex pens as well. Um, but my friend did get a, uh, he got a picture of uh, Batman. Um, I know um, Mark, I think, got a Rorschach uh, picture. I saw it on Facebook earlier on. Um, but yeah, that was amazing. I'm going to see if um, I can get my friend to bring it over with him and I can scan it and hopefully show you guys. Um, I might even try and, try and frame it myself if I can get a high enough quality copy of it. Um, what else do we got? We've got the uh, DC Futures End Zero Special Edition. What do you think of this setup, actually? It's quite, pretty good. That's just a little desk around, but it's working quite well. Um, you know, it kind of directs the light onto the book, and you can see it quite well. So, because the camera's pretty good on this, it's already a gigabyte file for eight minutes, but it's not a problem, is it really? Uh, I've got pretty quick internet, so uh, Rocket Raccoon Marvel number one. There you go, and I can see everything that's in the frame as well, which I couldn't before with the old camera. Um, Guardians of the Galaxy, the Marvel number one. And then, if you were early enough, you would have got this. Now it's guard. This is Labyrinth and Other Stories, free comic book day, hardcover. Nice. If you missed this, but you still want to get it, you can get it online. Um, just to cover postage, go to disposableherocomics.com. Uh, you'll be able to get that for just 99p, so uh, if you wanted to get that. Okay, um, so other things I bought, just to get up to speed with things. Um, let's start first with the manga. So I'm a big fan of Death Note. Um, I've got the black editions 1 to 6 and um, I bought the uh, Death Note 13 which is like the extra and kind of case notes and things about the uh, Death Note series which is quite cool. Um, just to complete it, I'm not sure whether it's the same size as those books, but it looks like it. 
looks like we're fitting nicely with them. Um, but yeah, also Forbidden Planet have a three for two um, thing as well, so you can get a get, yeah, get three for two, and it works out about the same price as if you was to go on Amazon. So it's really good. Um, I also got uh, Full Metal Alchemist. It's something I've heard a lot about. Uh, number one, two, and three collected volume. Oh, and then because there was another one free, I thought I wanted to get two, but you get another one free as well, obviously. So. I got the four, five, and six as well. There you go. Uh, and then to try and get up to speed, um, I bought myself a Saga Volume One. This is the trade paperback. I've got. Oh, I think it's the first four in comic version. Um, but I'm going to get the the Volume Two and Three in these as well to catch up quickly. So Saga Volume One. Um, and I've got up to 16 in the Walking Dead trade paperbacks, so I thought, why not? I got to 100 more, 103 in the single issues, and they're up to like 130 something now. Um, so I thought I'd catch up using these as well. So these were on offer as well, 30% off. So there's uh, trade paperback 17. That's um, 23 and 20. Yeah, something to fear because that was an ongoing thing over quite a few issues. Uh, but that's the 17, um, 18, what comes after, uh, 19, this was from Forbidden Planet, these were full price, but um, I always do, I always go to Amazon and think, oh, I can get this cheaper, but I just thought I'd just get it straight away, uh, March to War, number 19, you know the artwork, Robert Kirkman, and, uh, Where's the other one? Charlie Adler, that's the one. And then 20, uh, All Out War. But yeah, pretty sweet. I've got a nice lot to read. Plus the stuff I had already that I haven't read. Um, and I'm all going to get the uh, the Batman vs. Bane. It was quite cool. I've only really gone back on the, the uh, sub website and uh, had a look at what there is to, uh, to actually get. But there's a lot to order, a lot of comics to read. Um, but yeah, I want to say just a big sorry for not being around, but we'll be back. We've got loads of time now, so we'll be full flow with comics. Um, and yeah, if there's anyone you can suggest uh, for me to follow or subscribe to, uh, anything for me to read, any kind of ideas about light, lights and the video-wise, I think this is working quite well. Um, that'd be appreciated. And um, you know, nice to see Mark. Uh, nice to see you, mate. And... That's what I got, and I'm back. So, uh, yeah, I'm not living. Uh, what was it with the with the Mongols? Was it uh, Scott said? Um, but yes, that was getting quite on for a long video now. But I know you guys don't mind long ones, so um, I'm used to doing short videos now. But this is casual, so I like it. So that's what I got from Midland Planet. Um, Hope you all had a good free comic book day and hope you're all doing well. Um, but as for now, this is Jay back on the YouTubes with my uh, return video and haul. So I hope you enjoyed it and we'll see you all uh, very soon. We will be live. I might do a, a review of Thor, not Thor, Captain America. That's cool. Also, we'll do another shirt with the symbols like on both arms as well. I'll show you that when that arrives. That's pretty sweet. Um, yeah. Thank you for watching, guys. I'll see you all again very soon. Press the button. Uh...